<clears throat> so 2016 Optic 6 box half case break. And here's everybody up in it. So hopefully you guys are doing well. Hopefully this will be a good start to the weekend. Um, we're actually going to take, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to because, uh, <laughs> like I said, kids, wife, sick, everybody. So I'm going to, yeah, I know. I haven't, had a, I haven't had a frosty adult beverage since L.A., dude. So I have no idea. Needs Big Net needs some hits. Let's get, hey, can we get weird with Optic at least? Let's go. Let's go. Hey, so if you guys hit anything that you want to get graded, make sure to submit, uh, like I said, by Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. And don't forget, we got the big boy break. Listen, it's, it, I mean, it's, it's a big boy break for a reason. Good deal. Go Ducks goes, I'm in the second optic. I'm just creeping. I still love optic. Obviously. Stuff shot up. And uh, let's see. So at least we know we'll hit a couple hot boxes. I don't know exactly where they're going to be. But from what I've seen, the hot boxes don't, they, they have more, oh God. They have more autos, the hot boxes, but they're not as quality autos as the boxes that don't have the hot box. I'm just, I don't know, it's weird. Here's a rated rookies autograph of Braxton Miller. Yeah, go Ducks. It's, yeah, it's not, uh, yeah, it's not fun, man. I just feel bad for the little guy. <laughs> All he wants to do is just hang out. And I'm like, oh, man. <clears throat> Thought we were going to hit a Zeke first pack. We did not. All right, so like I said, all the rookies and inserts will go out. I'm only going to stop at the serial numbered stuff. And her, hello, Daniela Monet, out of 99. And Sean Robinson. Yeah, I think tomorrow will be a good day for me to try and recover a little bit because next week is going to be a big week. We got black gold, but then after black gold, it's just the big boy break, the Super Bowl break. Here's Carson Palmer at 149. Osweiler, Malcolm Mitchell. Uh oh, the other, other Kev. He's up in this joint. Here's the thing other, other Kev. What are your thoughts about possibly getting into the Super Bowl break? And what do you know about the Super Bowl break? 199, Kirk Cousins, Kenyon Drake. Miles Jack, Sua Cravens. Dude, contenders last night, we hit the Brett Favara silver ticket. So the attitude, the Troy ounce of silver. Uh, we hit a gorgeous, and when I say we, I mean go Ducks. Hit a really nice short print, uh, Paxton Lynch, Sepia, Derrick Henry, Cracked Ice. I mean, but we didn't hit anything out of that, that uh, the five box of Limited. And here's the thing, the last five box of Limited are sitting up on my freaking shelf. Here's Emmett Smith out of 149, Eli Apple. Like I said, all inserts rookies going out. So if I skip over them, it's not, I'm not trying to do it on purpose. I'm just trying to keep it moving. Open over 20 boxes, one blue Zeke Elliott Auto Redemption, red 50 auto Dak Prescott, 101 Ingram. Dude, I don't know how you're finding this stuff. I don't know how you're finding optic, unless you're just straight up going to blow out cards or whatever, but even those guys are starting to... How do you get into the big Super Bowl break? Um, you get into it, it goes on sale like any other break. The crazy thing is, only 32 people will enter. And if I've seen it before where some people have bought multiple spots because they're crazy birds like that. And uh, so, yes, it's just one break. It goes on sale just like any other break. Once it's gone, it ain't coming back. There's no other breaks to trade into it because you would just be absolutely insane to trade out of this monster, absolute beast of a break. Oh, you're going to the big game. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, the other other Kev. Going to the damn Super Bowl. 
Oh. I hope your Coors Light is super warm. Your very first one. I hope it is just like, they pour it out of there and they're like, oh, I'm really sorry. That's like the first beer we poured all day. And it is so warm, Kev. It's so warm. Get out of here with that talk. Gosh, dang it, dude. You know what? I'm. You know, Kev. I think I reacted. Uh, I think I overreacted a little bit. I'm sorry. Um, <clears throat> I don't wish a warm Coors Light on even my worst of enemies. <laughs> Here's Jerron Reed out of '99. Will Fuller. What? <laughs> $18 beers. It's a special at the Super Bowl. Um, yeah, Big Net. It's on Ultimate Box Breaks. Yep, just like all the other breaks we buy into. Gurley at a $199. Teddy Dixon. Dan Marino. Die cut. Derek Carr. Robert Namichi. Antonio Brown. $299. Bosa. Paxton, Malik Collins. So we're cracking the first optic. Everything's sold out right now. Here's J going back to back. Jacoby Brissett. And that's going to New England. Jamie R. So the Brissett out of 150. Uh, at Big Net, I'll get all those details up uh, next week, bud. But. It won't be on sale until later in the week. It is like a full day of breaking. No joke. It takes a full, like normally I split it into two days, but I think I want to do it in one single day this year. Um, just to, I don't want to keep anybody in suspense, but it's it'll be like an eight to nine hour break. It'll be awesome. Jerry Rice at a 149. You definitely get your bang for your buck. Oh, dude, so many guarantees, it'll be disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> Gator goes, are there going to be any guarantees? Come on, man, you know that. All right, Thomas Rawls at a 25, the freak. Oh, for sure, Big Net, absolutely, man. Like I said, dude, it, it, A, because nobody does anything on Saturday because they're getting ready for the big game on Sunday. They know that they're about to get turnt on Sunday. So everybody just kind of chills out on Saturday. It's a perfect way to chill out on Saturday. Here's the Gronk, 149, Vernon Butler. Xavier Howard, Alex Collins, and Literary Man. AP, Eric Murray, out of 199, Kelvin Taylor. All right, box number two. So we had uh, Brissett, Braxton, Miller, Autos so far. Out of this case, god-awful amount of inserts and rookies. Just get these boxes ready. Just put them right in. <laughs> Go Ducks said I opened a box today. <laughs> so yeah, before I get on camera, I do my little thumb exercises. Hit a Tevin Coleman rookie auto out of prestige. Should you grade it? All right. So um, that's a good that's a good uh, blanket. I think I think I can I think I can answer the question for a lot of people too. But Gator, uh, there's a really good article on the forum that I wrote. It's under the, uh, it's like PC tips and collection, all that kind of stuff. But it's on, I think the second page is whenever I chimed in. And just, it kind of runs down uh, the different ways to look at grades. So, um, but I can, I can kind of explain it while I'm here live because we got time to kill. Jod Ward at a 299. 
So what you first do, Gator fan, it's like those uh, diagrams. It's like if you answer yes, go this way. If you answer no, go this way. <laughs> so um, oh, I've cut my hand plenty of times. I just hide it really well. Here's Kenneth, Di <laughs> Kenneth Dixon. Sorry. Peyton Manning. Kenneth Dixon at a 149. Or Kenyon Drake, I apologize. Um, but if it's for your PC collection, go ahead and just do a yes for a grade. Because I, I grade a lot of my PC. Of course, you always take into consideration, you look at the condition of the card. If you see something glaring that you can see, guess what? Beckett's going to see the same damn thing. Okay, Gator fan, you read that? I'll just, I'll keep explaining a little bit. Um, Jarvis Landry, Eli Apple. If it's not for PC and you want to do it for resale value, then what you do is look up that exact same card. There's a nice dude. This freak is actually going to sell. KC just got their money back and some. One out of five green freak. That's pretty. Do you grade that? Possibly. I might grade an emerald freak. Um. But then, oh yeah, what you do is then you just look up the uh, the price of the card. Here's Cardell Jones. Out of 150, going to Schmuff or low. Uh, that's Waxman. There you go, Straw. I think you got your money back, Straw, for both breaks with just that one freak. Uh, so anyway, Tevin Coleman, Prestige. If you're going for resell, look what a Tevin Coleman auto sells for without a grade and then look at what the grade like what a, if they're already graded out there you look at the pop report if the pop report's low that might be an indicator to maybe go ahead and do it because you could find that one collector that really wants it but there's none out there and you have it um you want to look at uh the cost of the grade versus uh the price so like um 55 to 99 joe flacco so if a nine sells for X amount and a nine five only sells for a couple bucks higher, it may not be worth it to get it graded. Um, you know, if if it if it doesn't sell above, you know, because we know how much a grade costs. And so uh, that's Carlos Hyde. So yeah, there's a, yeah, a bunch of different factors that are in there. Freeman Hargraves. Ken Staler, Hackenberg, Austin Hooper. Hopefully, I was able Gator to. Um, yeah, but the time by the time you get it back, though, um, you know, because you got to really play on the emotions. It's just like the stock market, um, or maybe that's how I think of it because I'm in finance too. So, um, but it, it really does kind of mimic how people, you know, you got to sell on the hype, you know. Um, but yeah, I mean, the hype will die down by the time that grade gets back to you unless you expedite it. And at that point, it's I, I just don't think the card's valued at that much to where I would expedite it and send it by itself. So hopefully. Um, I'd put it up there. Yeah, I, I definitely put it up. And then if he, but, if he busts off a solid game, then somebody will sna snag it up real quick. What's up, Frankie P? Hey, AD. Oh, he goes, sup, ladies? Whoop, wrong chat room. So we're in the first uh, six box here. Pardon my voice, sorry. Everybody in the UBB household, even the little guy, under the weather now. So tonight will be the last night of breaks for the week. Uh, I was just running through some BGS... Um, some BGS stuff for you guys. This is Justin Forsett. The 149. Matty Stafford. Out of 50. Deck. Shuttle ranking. Xavier and Howard. But yeah, I was going through the big break, uh, the big Super Bowl break as well. Um, crazy guarantees, obviously. You know how, exactly how that goes. Uh, we got sponsors uh, involved. Blowout Cards jumped on board this year. This is the first year they've done it. And they stepped up huge. Um, and then uh, also Panini. Um, they're just unreal. And uh, they love us here. So 
and we appreciate it. And that's why we continue to support the products, support the events, all that stuff. So uh, Panini's going to get us all squared away as well. So we're very, very thankful for that. Um, I think TriStar's uh, going to jump on as well. A hot box, Kenneth Dixon. Out of 150, Kevin Hogan. So Baltimore, again. Roger, Russell, and James Bradbury. DeAndre, Jordan Howard. Malcolm Mitchell, which would be numbered out of 149, Derek Watt. Is that a bad, obviously, AD, that's a bad road to go through? Is that the Lincoln Tunnel? I don't know anything about it. Just saying. All right. Devontae Booker, 299. Chris Jones. All right, let's see a couple more autos out of this hot box. Latavius, TJ Green. I'll take his, you know what? B. Hayes, probably just got your 22 back right there on that Zeke. Sheriff out of 99, Shalik Calhoun. Wes Welker. Bradbury, Sterling Shepard. Maybe that was just a weird box that just had two autos in it. I don't know. I guess it was. Devontae Parker out of 99, Noah Spence. All right. Do we have two autos in there or just one? I don't remember. Okay. <clears throat> two more boxes left in the optics. Sixer. Then we have the remaining Sixer. After this, we still haven't hit a Zeke, Dak, Wentz, Goff, Henry, any of the big boys. Let's see if we can do it. I know. I thought we had it. Sheriff, Bladen, Gabbert, and Hunter Henry. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, that's just a weird box. Don't Google weird box. Don't do it. I mean, it is Friday, and you guys get a little, little weird on Fridays, but a Kevin Dodd, Demarcus Robinson. CJ, Eric Murray. Demarcus. Out of 149, Cody Kessler. Uh, still debating. Still debating. I'm telling you, there, there is a monster lurking in limited the last five boxes. But you guys, it's like pulling teeth with limited. I'm telling you, there is just a beast of a hit. There has to be. 31 out of 50, Frank Gore, Farrell Cooper. I think Limited looks pretty good. But yes, if we were going to do one more, I would, I would highly suggest and recommend Calvin Benjamin, Carl Nassib. <laughs> Thurman Thomas, CJ. Nick Vanna, Keenan Reynolds. Man, we need to get a little something out of here. Don't you dare ask Jeeves. All right, Carson Wentz, 49 out of 99. McKenzie Alexander. Don't you dare. Robert Namichi, Jeff Driscoll. Waterboy's ready to do it. Aaron Rodgers, Gary Barnage at a 199. Kavari Russell. But like I said, we won't have breaks uh, tomorrow. Uh, ooh. Trevor Davis. Sorry, there's an edge back there. Trevor Davis, little refractor, 26 out of 99. Remember, dude, if you guys hit anything that you want to get graded, make sure to submit. This is a perfect time to do it. I'll get the list all updated by the end of the weekend as well. Paxton Lynch, Will Fuller. <laughs> 149, Peyton Maine, Adolphus. Carson, 
Kelvin Taylor, Trevor Davis. One more box left in this side of Optic. Phil Rivers, Baby Gabbert out of uh, $2.99 and a Will Redman. Okay, we're due. We are due. Still making good time on this optic, all right? All right, so final box of optic. Good to have you guys on board. Let's see. Rivers, Jarvis, Landry out of uh, 299. Will Redman. Oh, geez. Kev. Okay, the only possible thing, Malik Collins, Blake Bortles, the only possible thing that I can think of. There was more SP info and contenders today? What, hey, AD, what was it? Four to 99, Marvin. X Factor, Julio, William Jackson, Leonte Carew. Gronk, Flacco out of 99, Jonathan Bullard. Yes, uh, yeah, it'll be next Saturday will be the Super Bowl break, the annual. What is this, like the fifth or sixth annual Super Bowl break? Dude, this one's, this one's for the record books. Remember how I said that the, the uh, kickoff break was the biggest break? Well, it was until now. It's this is awesome. All the all this stuff's going out regardless, but uh, 199. Bunch of variations are SP. Nice. Thurman Thomas, Gronk, Carl. Maybe the other half is hiding all of the good autographs. I'm not sure. Braxton, Demarcus. Paul Perkins, another green. I'll take it. Two out of five. So those green borders actually look pretty slick. Uh, so Big Net, guess what, brother? Got yourself a green Paul Perkins, two out of five. Uh, Big Net, uh, <clears throat> it's gonna be pricey. I still, I'm still figuring out, and I'm still locking in a couple late boxes, uh, and still trying to wrangle in a couple things. So I don't have the definitive number. But uh, it's, it's big. It's a big break. Nate Sudfeld, 270 at 299. Ricardo. Yeah, I can fire up limited. Yep. Let me just get through this. Let's get some hits. Here's uh, Jameis Winston, 199, Jeff Driscoll. See, if I just had one more set of arms... Just saying, I'd be halfway to being a spider, but I'd also be able to list up breaks the exact same time. Uh, over 600. And, okay. Blue Jared Goff. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pull a Goff. I'm going to steal it. Like Jared Goff steals our... Wait, it wouldn't make any sense for me to do it. Jared Goff would have to open a pack. I'd have to go up to him and then steal the card from him because that's what he did last week. So, going to K-Spec 01, there you go, buddy. If you guys haven't seen the video, go watch. It's hilarious. Uh, I, I, I don't know if I said anything back to him, but <laughs> Jared Goff. Oh, God. Russell, Will Fuller. So, nice Goff on the way out. K-Spec. Maybe all the big stuff is in the next half. I'm not sure. We're going to find out. Yeah, I mean, it's right around, um, yeah, uh, yeah, it's up there. I think it's right around like seventeen or seventeen or $18,000 in boxes. Uh, so, yeah, it was, uh, yep, yeah, no easy way to slice that up by 32, right? 
Um, and that doesn't include bonus, shipping, supply, oh boy, all that good jazz. So, 